guys welcome back to another video thank you so much for tuning in so this is going to be an update regarding the video well the viral video that went around um, with the Bulgarian talent show of the lady removing a whole face as we all saw and received a lot of backlash and received a lot of backlash with claims that it was blackface and of course I did a video about that and the show has responded so I'm going to share with you guys the response and also just update my opinion on it again I've been reading the comments that you guys have been sharing underneath the last video that I done and do you know what I appreciate every comment and I feel like this type of video is a type of video that is educational for everybody and I appreciate the fact that people have actually been respectful to an extent in the comments just before I get into the video if you are new feel free to hit the subscribe button let me know your thoughts in the comment section in the description is my PayPal and my cash app if you wanted to support my channel furthermore Mihaela Marinova I hope I've pronounced her name right impersonated Nosembo who had the hit track Jerusalem. Now there was a video that I wanted to share with you guys which I'm not going to post here because your girl is not trying to get no copyright strike but I will leave the link to the video in the description box and when I watched the video it kind of made me see this in a different way. It was offensive and my opinion definitely changed from my last video but like I said in my last video that was my instant reaction action was I saw talent coming from a theatre background this was my world you know makeup so to me I instantly saw talent I just saw that aspect of it I didn't I didn't see anything racial I didn't see blackface you know I saw wow like what did you use like was that whack yes the person may have looked weird but it was very well concealed so I hope that you guys can understand where I came from it wasn't like I was oblivious to the idea that they may have, you know, been doing blackface, but from my background, um, this is the theatre world, you know, this is the film world. Let's just have a look to see the statement that the show released. It is quite lengthy. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to read all of it, but I'll give it a go. And it says, Dear viewers, we are very surprised with the number of negative comments regarding the TV show your face sounds familiar. The Polish edition of the show, seen as exemplary abroad, always tries to show great performances, which strives to be as close to the original as possible. Incredibly important for us, as well as for the artists taking part in the show, is the charity aspect of the programme. Your Face Sounds Familiar is an entertainment show which invites celebrities to try and recreate image and the performance of famous and distinguished artists while trying to be as accurate in the depiction as they can. This is an idea known all over the world. The producers and contestants of all previous series of the show had always one thing in mind to recreate most accurately, vocally, movement-wise and visually and the big music stars of Polish and foreign origin which are selected for them randomly. A team of professionals watches over this. Okay, that is basically the statement that they, they put out. First of all, I couldn't even finish reading that whole statement. I don't know what this statement is supposed to be because I don't know if it was just me but I didn't really see any apology there. It just says we are very surprised with the number of negative comments regarding the show there's no we deeply apologize for anything like there's nothing you're basically telling me what the show is about that's not a statement to me again that's just like okay you're dismissing the comments you're dismissing the complaints like from the fact that you're dismissing the complaints already you're telling me that you don't care about the way that um, black people have raised their concern to me it's almost like you're saying you're not important enough like I don't understand what's this statement this long statement that I was just about to read like was it was it just me there's no apology you've literally taken your time to write all of that trying to be as accurate in the description as the artist okay you're talking about Missy Elliott Beyonce Alexandra the intention of each star performing on the show as well as the whole production team is to recreate the original which you already said that in the first post guys i'm extremely disappointed you know having discussions with my friends reading all of your comments i feel like this was just wrong and especially now that they've released a statement i'm like where's the apology i was fully trying to read 
read it through waiting to see what they were going to say and there is no apology you know sometimes that's why it's good to just reflect and sometimes it's good to conversate about these things because you can see where people are coming from be open-minded about it they've literally just dismissed disregarded everybody's concerns and they're just trying to explain what the show is about we we know what the show is about we can go on your website and have a look to see what the show is about but that's not People were not concerned about the show. People were concerned at the fact that she done this. And on top of that, if you guys wanted to head over to Twitter, um, I've left the link in the description to have a look at that video. You know, she's walking over doing ooh, goo, goo, ooh, ooh, gaga. It's like, and actually with her body um, doing a monkey movement. It's like, what? No, no, no. I'm tired guys like I'm just lost for words this is not it let me know your thoughts in the comment section I'll speak to you guys in my next video and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you are notified when I next post